I'm Tamara Lackey and I'm out here in downtown Durham, North Carolina shooting at a little park in the middle of a really busy area. There are a lot of noises from construction trucks and things backing up and trains and that actually makes it very difficult for me to be able to interact with the children and keep their attention. I'm going to be working with William, Owen and Gretchen as well as their dog Lizzie. Some of the challenges that I'm going to be facing are, in addition to the noise and distraction, are the fact that when you have three children, they have three different personalities, and you have to respond to each of them individually as well as a group. <laughs> Here we go. One key thing to keep in mind while I'm conducting the shoot is that it needs to be fun. <laughs> Very good. I'm using the Nikon D610 and the 24 to 70 millimeter f2.8 lens. I'm shooting dynamic, fast-moving subjects, so the D610 is perfect for that. It's a fast camera, it's lightweight, and allows me to get great photographs. My approach to this is I'm going to start out with something relatively safe in that I'm not terribly worried about it being the perfect shot. I'm going to have them running towards the lens, backlit, a lot of sun-washed flare kind of look. Um, and that will get them warmed up and getting what appears to be kind of candid shots, although I do know that I'm going for something in the way of shooting from the hip, quite literally. <laughs> the next scenario I'm going to go for is a really nice clear shot of all of their faces with the puppy together on the ground, bellies to the ground. I'm going to be shooting in the same fashion. Oh, Shalizzi loves you, Gretchen. In addition, I would love to be able to grab one portrait of a child and the puppy together in a fun, playful, interactive way. Okay, ready? Now you're gonna hold your puppy. Even though there are trains and traffic and construction and jackhammers and everything going crazy around us, I need to be able to do a combination of controlling the situation enough that I keep my subjects around me to get the images I want, um, but not so much that I squelch the natural enthusiasm that they're bringing. That playfulness and that fun aspect needs to be a part of the entire shoot. So I have to be able to go along with a lot of what happens as it happens. You know the shoot is a success when you walk away with great images a happy, playful group, and a pleasant exhaustion across the board.